Hello friends, today we will start with Sophos XG Firewall series. After completing this course, you will be able to administer Sophos XG Firewall and manage day-to-day -day tasks. So in this course content, we will be covering the presentations and practical lab exercises. So when we will be proceeding further, we will have uh, lots of theory understanding presentation through presentation and we will be of course having a uh, hands-on lab exercises. So in order to proceed, I will recommend you that you should at least have a VMware workstation installed with you and coming to that Sophos XG Firewall download installation and deployment definitely I will be doing that in the coming video and you can follow me at that time. The course content is as seen on the screen and it will take around 8 to 10 hours to complete our entire course which would be roughly around 12 to 15 tutorials approximately. So after completion of this we will start with the Sophos Central that is endpoint security from Sophos, Sophos Intercept X for PC with EDR, Sophos Intercept X for servers with EDR functionality. We will learn in detail about Sophos Synchronized Security. So upon completion of this tutorial, you will be able to recognize the main technical capabilities and how they protect against threats. Complete com common configuration task. You will be able to configure the most commonly used features. You will be able to view and manage logs and reports, identify and use the troubleshooting tools. So what are the prerequisites? There are no prerequisites for this course. However, it is recommended that you should have at least a knowledge of uh, networking to a CompTIA N plus level. You should be familiar with security best practices. If you are not familiar, then also it's okay as we will be proceeding with the course content Definitely, I will be make, trying my best that you understand each and everything very clearly. And yes, of course, if you have any doubt, you are most welcome to comment me in the comment box and I will be replying to your queries as soon as possible. You should have an experience as a beginner configuration for the network security devices. As I told you, if not, then definitely we will be uh, doing it together. So talking about the certification part, to become a SOFOS certified administrator, you should uh, take and pass an online assessment, the assessment test, the knowledge of both the presented and the practical content. The passing marks for the assessment is 80% and is limited to 4 attempts. So this will be our network design guys. We will be downloading the image of a SOFOS firewall and we will be deploying in our VMware workstation. We will be connecting a LAN port that is uh, the port A of the firewall will be designated as a LAN port. And this will be the IP scheme on the LAN side where we will be having uh, two client PCs and one Active Directory for the authentication and the integration of the Active Directory we will be learning over here. Then we will be having a WAN side port we will be designated as a WAN port which will be bridged to your host laptop, uh, the laptop or PC on which the VMware workstation is installed. That particular port, port B of the firewall we will be bridging to the host laptop and that will be facing towards the internet side, the IP scheme for my uh, host laptop is this. So I have used this IP scheme, but if you have some other IP scheme, uh, you can use that. Definitely I will guide you when we will be moving further in the coming lectures. Uh, port C is designated as a DMZ port. We will be placing our web server in this port C uh, on the port C side and we will be seeing that how the netting uh, works, how the proxies work, how the reverse proxy work, web protection, application protection, installation of the certificates, logging and so much to come. So guys be connected with me and in the coming video, in the coming tutorial uh, we will be quickly uh, downloading the image file. I will show you how we can download the image file and we will proceed with the deployment. So thanks for watching my video. If you like my video please subscribe to my YouTube channel and share with your friends. Thanks and see you in the next video.